Hey, welcome back to The Predicament, TRS style. Um, one of the things we're seeing is that a lot of people now are trapped at home. We are at home and we're gonna be at home for another month and it's sometimes hard to get the kind of equipment we need to be able to take care of ourselves, things that we used to take for granted when we had access to gyms and fitness studios. And one of the things I wanna show you is that, this is very old school, but you know we think that you really should have a band. It makes a lot of mobilizations a lot more effective. And if you don't have a, a band, I do want to show you that you likely have an inner tube lying at your house. So um, we did some early, early episodes, but the in part of this edition is uh, I want to show you guys options that you have. And if um, you know clearly it doesn't quite have the same properties as the jump stretch band, but if, sometimes if you hook two of them together, you can get enough tension in there, enough springiness, that you can access what you want. So you may need to double the rubber band or double the inner tube or at least hook two of them together and you can do that. And of course everyone knows how to hook them together, but you just loop one through and then just make a little loop through. So that is how you can you know, extend your band or get enough stretch. But what I want to show you also is that we feel like this is a perfect time for you to understand some of the techniques we use around voodoo flossing. And so clearly we think that everyone should have a floss band on the planet for even if it's just dealing with swelling, uh, you know, you have a, a, an overuse injury, something's congested, it turns out to be a really effective tool uh, for a long time now, we've seen. But again, if you don't have access to one now and you know you're gonna be at home for a minute, um, being able to make one makes a difference. So I'm gonna take this beautiful tire, sorry, it's a 27.5. No one in our house rides 27.5 anymore. We're all in 29ers. So sacrifice to the, uh, to the voodoo gods. And what I'm doing here is I'm just gonna cut off the, the stem and show you that you can then split this thing up the middle here and if we split it up the middle just follow the seam and I'm just gonna do a piece of it here I won't, I won't take you through the whole thing but what we want you to do is have an, um, an opportunity to be able to solve this and more importantly if you find yourself in a, a strange place where suddenly you realize you wish you had a voodoo band and you can't get one. This is actually the technique that we use with a lot of our aid workers. This is the technique we've used with the military when some of our guys and gals have found themselves out in positions and places where there is, they don't have access. And so then you're just going to split this down the middle and just it doesn't have to be perfect. But one of the things that we want everyone to understand and appreciate is sometimes when you're traveling, if you turn an ankle or have a sprained thing, you may or may not be able to walk out or continue to work or manage that sprain the way uh, we would in the clinic. And one of the things that we know from our experience is that we've had lots of feedback that understanding and having this technique in your back pocket can be a lifesaver, whether you're on a family vacation and you've sprained your ankle on the first of seven days of hiking, or you're an aid worker uh, working in Haiti and uh, have no access. So suddenly what I've done is we've just split that in half, and this actually does give us a fair amount of wrapping. And so what we see is that we have, you know, not the idealized, but both of them are, tend to be latex, um, this one's just a little stretchier, but suddenly you do have access to that, to that stretchy band voodoo kind of concept that we're, we're fans of in terms of solving mechanical problems. So if you're at home, you've got a hotspot, tons of uh, videos from Mobility Wad and Ready State about how to use the voodoo floss to decongest and manage pain. And if you don't have a voodoo band and can't get one right now, or you find yourself traveling or on the road or in competing, usually there is an old bike laying around and you can quickly barter uh, for an old inner tube tire. I can't tell you how many times we've had friends on exotic bike tours, tweak something, wake up with something swollen, and then uh, be able to put the flames out themselves by taking an inner tube tire, breaking it down, and even creating this, or, taking that inner tube tire, breaking it down, and creating this. So both options are good, but we just were trying to give you guys some ideas in the predicament. Make yourself feel better at home, it's up to us.